guys, welcome back to another video. So um, as you've just seen, I've just got both my rods out and uh, we're all set for a little session down Brighton. Um, it's not looking too good so far because we just spoke to a couple of anglers that have been here for about six ang uh, six, anger? six hours and um, they haven't had a bite all day. So, But they've fished the tide down and back up a bit, but we're fishing it over high tide. So hopefully we'll have a bit of a better chance. Um, down here with Reese today, he's just behind me there and uh, hopefully he can bag a few plates. They're the main targets. Um, I wouldn't mind a few flounders and dabs if they're around or even maybe a rocklin. Just hopefully we don't catch any uh, whiting. But the, uh, the sea's looking all right. It's not overly dirty, but it's not crystal clear. So uh, yeah, we're gonna give it a go. There's quite a lot of breakers out there. I'll pan you around and I'll give you a little show. fishing on the east side of the banjo groin today um, this is where we normally fish and in the past past year I've had quite a few play from here so hopefully a few come out today um, I haven't had any massive ones here but we'll see show you a few of the baits that we've got today. So in here we've got some beautiful black lugworm, perfect ready to use, beautiful size and hopefully the police are, the police are fight the place are feeding on them. Yeah beautiful. It's a lovely live black lug. And over here we've got a bunch of uh, low lug and some lovely little ragworms. Beautiful. Here we go, Reese is into the first uh, place. Oh no, it's a flounder. It's a flounder, is it? Yeah, it's a flounder. Oh well, fish is a fish. Well done, mate. Happy days. So guys, it's um, not going very well so far for me. Reese has had one flounder, but that's literally about it. Um, I haven't seen any bites. But we've got two hours till high water now and this should be the time that we'll get the place. So we've got two hours till high water and it's also two hours until it's dark so place into the dark we'll see. I hope it's not a blank from me. I'm up to um, sandbanks on Friday fishing with uh, Shane fishing Dorset live so uh, hopefully bag a few plates up there I'll be after a small eyed ray as well, or a blonde ray. So we'll keep watching the rods. Hopefully they start tick tapping in a minute. Um, but the conditions aren't great for them today. But we'll see, we'll keep going and we'll try our best to get one. But can't be it for the weather today. It's actually beautiful. Look at that sun, how amazing, eh? Go on, let's hear Tippy Tappy. Out there. Look at that one. It's been speared or something. Got a hole in it. Beautiful. Out there then. There we go, guys. Lovely double shot of place. Good days. 
Ooh, that's done up in. Look at that hole. A weird hole in it. How strange. Yeah, happy days. Right, I'll get one looked and I'll uh, give you another show. Right. Here we go. Happy days. Beauties. They're not overly big, but uh, they'll do. Beautiful. Wah! Right, I'm going to get his back, get that rig straight out of there because we're losing light very fast. So hopefully we can get some more. Fingers crossed. Have to be careful here, guys. Go, 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 go. They'll go out to the side. They'll flip over and they'll be gone. Happy days. There you go guys, another little place. It's uh, just getting dark, but I've had uh, three places and two casts now. Um, so I'm going to get this little fella back, he's quite deeply hooked, so uh, I had to do a bit of surgery on him. But he's all good, he'll swim back, and uh, I'll get the base back out there. So Reese just pulled in one of these. It's now pitch black. So uh, I think we're gonna give it 20 minutes and then we're gonna head home. We don't wanna catch, waste our worms on these. But uh, yeah, at least caught another fish, you know what I mean? That's gonna be my last cast, guys. I just loaded up both hooks with a load of ragworm. Just hoping for anything, really. Probably won't get a place now it's uh, pitch black. But you never know, could pick up a nice bass. Let's get out there and have a chat. Found a few of the old mermaid's purses on the beach, so must be a few rays around. This is what uh, the rays lay. These are ray eggs. They release these and they give uh, birth to live birth. Come out of there, look. Quite interesting. So I've been getting a few tippy tappies on this rod. So uh, it's my last car, so I'm gonna bring it in and we'll have a look and see what we got. I suspect it's probably going to be a whiting or two. So um, I'll bring it in and we'll see what we got. There we go. As suspected, a little tiny whiting. So I'll get this little fella back. I'm going to pat down this rod. We're going to make our way home. We've got a little bit of a drive home, so it'd be nice to get home at a decent time. 
But yeah, thanks all for watching. Um, don't forget to like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. And I may be collabing this video with my trip down to Sandbanks on Friday. So we can see how the two fish. So uh, keep tuned, keep the notifications on, and we'll see you soon.